Hello everybody, welcome back to Munich. We are here in the spot we've been before. Maybe have a look up there in the corner. Find the video of how the Oktoberfest looks like when there's no Oktoberfest, which was on a very sunny day. A few days ago, I'm back here today to have another look at the uh, Theresienwiese and the way to the north. Let's see what happens. Have fun. So this is right the bypass in the east of Theresienwiese. Imagine these Oktoberfest times, these 16 days a year, which will again not happen this year. All this area here would be locked off. Yeah, right. They are locking off this way and making it really hard for the locals to pass by here because they just need room for security measures. I don't know. They just take it. Today the weather is not as nice, but I think it's good enough. Imagine here the carousel alley would be in full place. The beer tents over there on the other side of the Theresienwiese. And now walking here at the right edge of the Oktoberfest grounds towards Oktoberfest station and beyond. Beautiful church, of course you have seen it before if you watched the video of the Oktoberfest, it's St. Paul's, Paul's Cathedral. Very beautiful one. And today we will go past the church to the north, towards the main line of trains, maybe watching some trains, we'll see. So my former, one of my former co-workers, she used to live in one of these houses, can't remember which one, I think it was the yellow one. Hi Sally. Don't know how long they lived there. I think it must have been a torture during these two special weeks every year when you're not able to drive your car to your own house. Because the street was to oh, totally blocked. Here we go. So this is the front of St. Paul's Cathedral. It's a really nice one. Maybe we have the chance to go inside it in another video. I'll have a look. Not today. Today we're going somewhere else. What is that? in the 80s or was it in the 70s there were once was a bomb attack on the Oktoberfest it's possible that this is a memorial for the victims of this attack I don't know looks like a memorial anyway This restaurant here is of course closed as well, but the banner we just walked by meant, hey, we are selling beer to go. 
Come in and get one. Won't do that now. Opposite to the popular uh, opinion, not all people in Bavaria are drunk all the time. And we are also not drinking beer all the time. <laughs> drinking beer quite often, not always. And there was this nice little park after exiting the Togofest aerial. And the way to and from the Togofest is basically via the U-Bahn or via the S-Bahn. The U-Bahn station uh, Theresienwiese, seen in the last video, exits right onto the Theresienwiese. There are two other U-Bahn stations, Goetheplatz and uh, Schwanthalerhöhe which are both close to the Oktoberfest area. But to the S-Bahn, the shortest way is the one I'm taking right now. Out to the north. Over that footbridge, over the Landsberger Straße. And through this alley towards Hackerbrücke. And right on the corner here in front, the bridge will start. Hackerbrücke. One of the oldest bridges of Munich. It doesn't go over a river or over a street. It was only over the railway. <clears throat> and I think I mentioned that in some other videos too, that the entrance to uh, Central, Sta Central Station, the railway tracks, is one of the widest piece of railway in all Europe. So this is Hakabrücke, classical iron construction and with a very nice view towards Central Station and the city behind it. Wow, there are a lot of trains in here right now. I see ICEs, I see Meridian, I see Regional Expresses, the Alex here in front. That's a hell lot of trains. And this is the iron construction of Hackerbrücke. And here is not only an uh, S-Bahn station that all lines serve. This is also the central bus station. This building with a strange roof is quite new. I think five, maybe ten years old. Office shopping mobility. And there is the central station for long distance buses that serves the city of Munich. Right next to Central Station for the rail. And that's it for this one. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe. See you soon, back in Munich. Goodbye.